And right now we're following up on a CBS 4 News investigation into a Miami nurse who is on administrative leave after allegedly posting disturbing pictures on social media. We're looking into what training nurses go through to prevent this very thing from happening. CBS 4's Austin Carter broke the story for us last night at 11. He joins us live now from JMH with the very latest. Austin. And Elliot, I've learned this afternoon that this nurse is still on administrative leave. She's been with Jackson Health since 2016. The fate of a Jackson Memorial Hospital nurse who posted photos of a sick baby on social media is still not known. We're not showing you those pictures in full because of privacy laws, but we can show you the captions. A CBS 4 News viewer sending us the disturbing posts on Wednesday outraged by what they saw. The same day, Jackson Health System said in a statement, as soon as we learned of this potential breach, we immediately placed this employee under administrative leave pending the outcome of the investigation. Jackson Health also provides privacy policy training to all their employees on a regular basis and that employees who violate privacy rules despite education can face disciplinary action as far as termination. Miami litigation attorney David Weinstein says in addition to patient protections, thanks to HIPAA, there is a general expectation and sense of decency in a place like a hospital. And here in Florida, if you're going to record what I say, you have to get my permission to do it. We're a two-party consent state. And then with images, you have a certain expectation of privacy that... And again, we are not showing those pictures, and certainly from this piece, you can understand why. Now, on one of those captions, though, you may have seen the hashtag gastroschisis. Well, that's actually a birth defect where the baby's intestines are outside of its body. We're live at JMH. I'm Austin Carter, CBS 4 News.